What's up, everybody? This is Jerry Avila from Capital Mortgage Services and the VC Mortgage Pros. Again, just sharing some valuable information. Wanted to give you a little bit of insight in regards to the VA home purchase uh, and how that combines with you have a veteran, uh, non-veteran uh, spouse, and potentially even a veteran and a veteran, and how that home purchase comes together. Uh, I've heard many times uh, the question asked, can a veteran and a veteran buy, or can a veteran and a non-veteran buy? Uh, and I'm gonna try to break those down real quick here for you. So if you're a veteran and you're entitled to your VA benefits, yes, you can receive 100% financing, and whether or not you pay that uh, funding fee will be up to whether or not you're exempt or not. Secondly, you'll be a veteran plus spouse, and you can have 100% financing because the way it's looked at is, is one combined uh, person uh, when it's reviewed all it is is that they take into account the credit the liabilities and also uh, the income now when you're talking about a veteran and a veteran you can still have a veteran and a veteran purchase a home together all they have to do is pay their own portion of the funding fee so this individual pays their funding fee and this individual pays their funding fee if one of them is exempt and the other one pays the funding fee guess what this person still pays their funding fee if they're both exempt guess what no funding fee that means it's all waived uh, and then last but not least would be a veteran and a non-veteran now, when you purchase as a veteran or non-veteran, that other individual that is not a veteran and does not have any VA benefit, then what will happen is that they will not be able to receive that 100% down payment. You will have the funding fee, half of it will go towards a veteran, and whatever that funding fee is, or whether it's waived, that settles that, and then you still have to come in with the other half of that funding fee portion, which is 12.5%. So the way it's looked at is about a 12.5% down payment. So sometimes those are the situations where you'll require a uh, second review uh, of a potential different product. Just depends on whether or not it makes sense based off of the interest rate that you're gonna get on a VA home loan, since we all know it is much nicer uh, of a rate than you do on a conventional purchase. So uh, again, thank you very much for watching the video. We look forward to helping you guys out. And if you have any questions, feel free to comment, like, and share this video. Again, this is Jerry Avila from Capital Mortgage Services and the VC Mortgage Pros. And again, we're here to get it done.